I will tell you that that journey was fraught with depression. That journey was fraught with moments of wanting to end life. That journey was fought through periods where the very people who loved me and wanted the very best in my life abandoned me because they thought that my passion for this activity we call trading was actually a stupid one. They felt my loved one. Now, some of you might have the, the, the amazing benefit of having the support of your loved ones and your family, but I didn't. And so during my first six years, there was nothing but darkness. There was nothing but loss. There was nothing but this long, seemingly never ending journey of discovering what, what did not work loved ones. My family felt that I was actually throwing my education away. They felt that I was ruining my life. They felt that I was involved in an activity that was nothing more than going to the casino and gambling my money away. But I want to tell you what happened last week to me. After a training session I held on Monday and one of these traders reached out to me and begged and said, Oliver, listen, I really need to speak to you because I'm at or on my last leg here. Sometimes in this business, your very, very loved ones will not be there to support you. And that is a true reality. Sometimes the, the person that you lay next to in bed every single night is your number one enemy when it comes to you becoming a success at trading because that person, as much as you love that person, does not understand your passion. I immediately reached out to the trader. And the trader told me, Oliver, listen, once again, I find myself motivated. You, Oliver, are a master motivator. I came into this Monday wanting to quit, wanting to end this activity, but once again, I am fired up. I'm motivated, but Oliver, I know what's going to happen. What is going to happen later today or tomorrow, Tuesday, or maybe it might take until Wednesday, but what's going to happen to me is what happens to me every week. Oliver. I'm gonna lose my motivation. This is my reality, Oliver, he told me every single week. And I don't wanna be on this roller coaster, help me. And I instantly told this trader that, listen, you don't need any more motivation. You see, motivation is not your problem. You've got motivation. I provide you that motivation. At times, you provide yourself that motivation. You know what your problem is? You need more discipline does not understand your passion for this. Sometimes the very people that you break bread with every single day at your dinner table will be the individuals that actually purposefully want to stand in your way to gain success at this. None of my friends understood this. I took little part-time scrappy jobs for pennies to fund a big part of my survival. In fact, I will say that the majority of moments were un non motivated moments, but motivation came through every now and then and gave me a jolt. And so I receive the question regarding motivation almost every single week of my life. Motivation you have up the wazoo. Motivation you have internally at times from yourself. Motivation sometimes comes from a quote. Sometimes comes from an Instagram post you scroll through. Sometimes motivation comes from a loved one. Sometimes motivation comes from a movie. Sometimes motivation comes from Oliver Velez. You have enough motivation in your life, but what you don't have enough of is discipline. And I went on to continue to explain to this trader that there is a vast world of difference between being motivated and being disciplined. 